hello everyone welcome to my channel today we are going to see the video of how total station is set up on the field and what should be checked before starting any survey i suggest everyone to follow this step before starting any survey this will help to make sure if the device has any error or not i have seen many surveyors doing survey without checking of the device and later their whole survey need to be resurveyed again just by giving extra five minutes you can be sure if your device is okay or not okay let me show you a demo video setting sending total station this is sending r5 total station inside the box there are machine appear a battery charger operation manual adjusting tool kit and a rain cover okay this is tool kit you can see this is generally used by repair person the brush is used for cleaning the device you can see this is rain cover which also protect against emergency rainfall this is operation manual how station can be set up and how other work can be done through this total station okay now let's go to the device let's put the battery inside the device and see okay this is battery adapter and i'm putting the battery and now let me power on the device okay you can see the device is power on you can see the logo now we'll go to the field part first we need to set up the tripod but the tripod should be set as per topographic condition uh, in my context there is level differences so i'm adjusting as per my field requirement Okay. while setting up the tripod what you need to be careful is just level the tripod up to your required height i have seen many surveyor keeping the height either high or low this will not only delay the survey it will also uh, make you back pain every time either bending or stretching and doing survey is not good this will delay your survey okay now we'll the tripod is level to leveling and you can see the total station is put on the tripod okay now let's see bubble and see the bubble is outer on the one side so first we need to adjust the bubble what you need to do is first deal with the central bubbling and then only will go to plate bubble on the upper side by using those three tripod leg you need to bring bubble inside a uh, black ring you can see every total station has black ring on the circular bubble by using three leg just bring the bubble inside the circular black ring okay let me show you okay now my bubble is tentative inside the circular ring now by using three foot screw i can bring those uh, bubble to the exact center okay now my circular bubble is on the center now second step is i need to uh, label the upper plate bubble also okay now what i will do is i will make one display face with parallel to the tri batch you can see my display face is parallel to the tri batch face and then by using the two foot screw i will center the bubble okay now once my bubble is centered from the that side now i will turn the device to other side of the tri batch tri batch face and then by using the third screw foot screw i will bring the bubble towards center again Okay, this is a mandatory process okay now my bubble is on the center on both sides so now i'll check with the third side okay now my bubble should be on the center on the third side if that's okay now we can proceed on the third step now third step is 
to power on the device and check the electronic bubble not every total station has electronic bubble so if it has then you need to check it as well otherwise you can work with upper plate bubble okay now my device is on now what i'll go i'll do go to the level and see the electronic level okay now you can see electronic bubble is shown on the screen and if i click page button now numbering details are also shown okay now those level error should be below 10 or the more accurate you can level the more precise your surveying will be in my context below 10 second is okay now i'll adjust to zero on one face and i'll rotate the device to other face and see you can see the error level if it's below 10 on both the side then uh, it's okay under general surveying now the fourth step is checking of angle this is the important phase of checking if the device is okay or not for that just mark a cross on around 15 to 20 meters on the field okay in my context i have marked on the pole and what i'll do is i'll go to zero set and set horizontal angle at zero degree and i'll note horizontal and vertical angle okay my vertical angle is 90 degree 9 minute and 51 second now again i'll turn the device and target the exact same point which i have targeted from the other face and see my angle reading okay you must be careful while targeting it should be on the exact same point which you have targeted from phase one okay now i have targeted to the exact same point and and then now i will note the again angle details okay now my horizontal angle is 179 degree 59 minute and 59 seconds and vertical angle is 269 degree 50 minute and 13 seconds now what the result should be is the difference of horizontal angles will be 180 degree and then the sum of vertical angle should be 360 degree below or above this is considered as error okay in my contest my horizontal angle is error one second and the vertical angle has error of four second since this device is of five second accuracy i will consider this error as acceptable and then now i can proceed with formal surveying one thing we miss to check is the centering this device has laser plummet so there is a laser centering here you can see the laser light is powered on this should be checked after leveling the in instrument okay some has optical plummet so you need to see from the optical hole by this way you can check up the device if the error gets under your tolerance limit then you can proceed the survey else you can first correct the device and then only start surveying this will just take you around 5 to 10 minutes additional time to check the device if you will do this then i am sure you won't have to regret it later i have seen many surveyor starting survey without checking the device and then later either they need to um, uh, make the data edit the data or they need to resurvey the whole area this is not good we need to keep habit of checking the device before starting any uh, large survey okay